In 2020, the pandemic was something altogether new for lawmakers. They had never experienced anything like it. In fact, they had to shut down the session for several months until things finally got a hold and a better understanding about what was going on. Now that we've been living for the better part of a year now in this pandemic, lawmakers, well, they're going to be back here at the Capitol. And here's what we know about this year's session. Face coverings won't be required for lawmakers, their staff, or the general public coming into the Capitol. They'll be available for anyone who wants one. Something else to note, if a lawmaker or a staff member or anyone else who works at the Statehouse tests positive for coronavirus, they don't have to tell anyone. Same goes for if they're identified as a close contact with someone who tested positive. Lawmakers and staff can choose to self-identify if they do test positive and report it to their boss. But it's up to leadership to tell the public about a positive test. Getting into the state house, you will need to go through security just like always, the same process. Last session, you had to go through a temperature check as well just to get inside. Journalists, the general public, you can sit all up in the gallery of the House and Senate and observe what's going on in both chambers. All committee meetings will be live streamed through a special link on the legislative website. You can attend a House meeting in person, but getting a seat in the room First come, first serve basis, and there are limitations. Senate committee meetings will happen in the Senate chamber, so you can sit in the gallery for those as well. We have a full outline on the protocols to expect if you do come to the State House this session. All those details are at weareiowa.com. In studio, Elias Johnson, Local 5 News, We Are Iowa.